Seigneur, où c'est le mien moins? Où c'est mon Dieu moins? C'est où qui vous êtes en train de faire à côté de mon Dieu? Many years ago, uh, Archbishop McCarthy, who was the Archbishop of Miami at the time, uh, developed a sister diocese relationship with the Diocese of port de -Pay, which is in the Northwest Department, the poorest department in Haiti. As a result of that, uh, there have been certain projects that have been developed between the Archdiocese of Miami and also the Diocese of port de -Pay. The Center for Justice and Peace, now the Center for Social Concerns, began to uh, go to Haiti to test the need, to see what was needed. A grant was written through the Jesse Ball DuPont Foundation to instigate and install a solar project. This came out of a need in the Cathedral of St. Anne and by the rector, Father Leonville Kenwa, due to the fact that he is working in an area that has no electricity. We have to ask for a parish, a parish cathedral, which has a lot of groups that have repetitions, which has a lot of people who have made their research, which has a lot of people who have a lot of present, who have a lot of people who have a lot of people who have a lot of formation, seminars, and who have a lot of community. Et voilà, ils sont obligés, depuis à ce arrivé, les pagaies d'électricité publique, ils sont obligés à le dormir bonheur. Au nom papa, à petit là, à l'esprit saint, Amen. As the rector of the cathedral, Father shared with us how difficult it is for the people to worship, as well as for the children to study. Parce que imaginez, dès que nous avons un coup, le coup a été fait plus vite, plus rapide. Nous décalons ça pendant pile bagaille, mais le fait que par exemple électricité pour que coup aille en déprojeté, donc ça ne fait que vous vous servez j'ai pas une note, du moins fait feuiller, etc. Mais quand il y a électricité, coup a projeté et puis ça fait d'une façon plus rapide. Et en plus, chalet à red. Ça veut dire que l'air que nous là, donc le soleil a commencé chaud, donc pas de ventilateur, pas de rien, pas de air. Donc ça veut dire que nous transpirons en pile. Donc la condition elle même n'est vraiment pas favorable pour nous parce qu'il était avec l'électricité. Installing solar panels on the roof of the cathedral complex. Uh, will enable uh, the cathedral, the cathedral school, the rectory, and some of the surrounding neighborhood to have electricity uh, because uh, there's a lot of sun in, in Haiti and so solar panels work. Monsignor Cassell has a deep relationship with a vocational school in Port-au-Prince called Haiti Tech. He was one of the founders of it and has stayed very, very active. Our project was to develop some kind of an educational enterprise in Haiti that would help transform the country. Uh, it turned out that what everybody told us that was that there was a tremendous need for a technical school. And we were able to uh, found what is now known as Haiti Tech. We realized that a good way to really make this a collaboration and to honor the learning at both our university and at Haiti Tech Vocational School was to see if the Haiti Tech students could do the installation of the new wiring. Moi même moi c'est Fritz Dominique qui c'est coordinateur projet en Haïti pour Haiti Tech. En Haïti va un courant surtout pour de père a dit même que tu as un petit courant des aides temps mais courant ça faible il pas ca servir à rien. Donc moi trouver projet ça son projet qui important un projet qui bienvenu. If we 
didn't have Haitians doing this work, what would happen when something needed to be repaired? There'd be no one in the country that knew what, what needed to be done. So it was important for us to, to always use Haitian expertise and Haitian labor to get the project done. Haiti Tech did a fabulous job on the installation. I've done dozens of installs outside of the U.S. and hundreds inside the U.S. and they've done one of the cleanest jobs we've seen and I'm learning as much from them as they are from me and it's been a fantastic experience. And Lord, thanks a lot about everything. Please give us this favor. At six o'clock in the morning, when the first celebration started, and hundreds of people were in the cathedral, the lights were on, the fans were on, the sound system was on, and so everyone was able to hear the celebration. The music instruments were able to be used, and it was all powered by our solar project. We were blessed with an amazing talent show by the young people of port de -Pay. Father Leonville and the community just shared how much this project meant to them. Because you share your love with us. Because you share your friendship with us. You know we love you. And we are sure also you love us. I appreciate so much everything you do for us. Today, we are a true family. And at that moment, I saw the faces of the children that won't have to study at the gas station anymore. We danced, we ate together, and we celebrated the collaboration of so many people. I think the most emotional moment for me at the, for this project was saying goodbye to Fritz. And he shook my hand and said, I hope we work together again. My hope for the future is that we can be exposed and reach out to other organizations who might be interested in funding projects in the northwest of Haiti so that the students of St. Thomas and our relationship with Haiti Tech can develop and move forward. There's so much more need in Port-au-Pay for more solar energy. Nous apprécions en pile, en pile, en pile tout effort qui fait et nous espérons tout le monde à comprendre dans cette formation université l'importance d'un projet comme ça et nous penser que nous participer dans ça. Moindre effort que nous faisons, bon Dieu a béni nous. Surtout que nous-mêmes, nous avons aidé dans ce monde que nous ne connaissons pas. Là, bon Dieu a beau plus. Bon Dieu a béni nous. Bon Dieu a béni nous. A small group of people really can make a difference when we work together.
Ah, you need uh yeah, you, yeah, want, yeah. you want I'm working. Yeah. Okay. No problem. Mm.